If you are feeling dubious about heading back into the post-COVID world, breathing in lungfuls of potentially contaminated air, then you should watch this and take note. Are you gagging for a swim? Worried you'll swallow someone's COVID gauze? Well, face keenies have made a comeback, and visitors to a recently reopened water park in Wuhan donned facial tightness to protect themselves not only from those hateful UV rays, but apparently also from the deadly virus. What's a face kini? Well, typically sported by women of a certain age in China, the face kini is a very unique face covering swimwear that protects against harmful rays whilst offering glamour and flair, apparently. However, the post-COVID world has relaunched the face knit as a must for all swimmers in a bid to prevent spitting squirtles spreading their potentially lethal saliva everywhere. Ah, here's a smurf gimp. This is the pink gimp. This is just a lizard pretending to be a human. These are Mexican wrestlers. That's a mannequin. She's not even wearing it right. And that's just a torn condom. According to the report, the water park has restricted its capacity to just 30%. Visitors also need to have their temperatures checked and their health QR code scanned to enter. The face kini, however, is not required. Want to learn more about the origin of the face kini? Probably not, but if you do, here's a video narrated by someone very excited by them. Check out the face kini. It's a mask Chinese women wear to help them keep that white complexion while they swim at the beach. The face kini was invented by Zhang Shifan. It first entered the market in 2004 and swiftly became a hit item at the beaches of China's coastal city of Qingdao. However, young children at the beach complained that the monotone face kini looked too scary, so Zhang turned to Peking Opera for inspiration to enhance her designs. Zhang says she never imagined the face kini would become so popular, selling about 30,000 pieces last year. The internet has some comments on China's face Kini trend. Twitter user Mark Adamos Pillen said he finds it so strange and out of place. Twitter user Shirley Mante said the face kini is just plain wrong. Your thoughts? If you want more Tomo in your life, click the subscribe and bell button so you get notified when a new video is up. Thanks for watching Tomo News.